We're making a three cheese mac and cheese today. We have some red cheddar, some gruyere, and a Parmigiano Reggiano cheese, which is 18 months old. So, take all your cheese and just grate it on the highest setting because this is gonna melt anyway. Your gruyere, Parmesan cheese. Put your pot onto a scale and measure out 50 grams of butter. I swear it's 49. And 50 grams of flour. Put this on a low heat and create your roux. Cook out your roux for five minutes before we add some really, really cold milk. The flour is cooked out. You can add some dry thyme, some cayenne pepper, a nutmeg. This nutmeg is special because it's from Penang, which is just north of from where I live. So just a touch. Bit by bit. Slowly. Cook the milk out a bit to make this thicken. Cook your pasta for 10 minutes to 12 minutes, depending on how you like your firmness. We're gonna switch off the heat and add our cheese. So save some cheese for the top. And this is our cheese sauce for the mac and cheese. Okay, so once you drain off your macaroni, off into a big mixing bowl. You know, this is, this is very much a personal thing. I like my mac and cheese really, really creamy, whereas my cameraman likes his mac and cheese really firm with a bite. But it's my show, so I'm gonna do whatever I want. Dude, this is not creamy enough. I want it more cold. We have several serving options. You can serve this in little ramekins and serve it one by one to each person. Or you can serve it family style in a bacon proof dish. Or if you bring this to a party and you don't want to bring your dish back, just in one of these tin things. Every corner. Sprinkle your cheese on top. Just a thin layer. And over here we have some roasted garlic breadcrumbs. If you want to be extra cheeky, just give it a little dusting all around. Set your oven to 250 and just let the top brown. We just want to create a crust, we don't want to cook this any further. Yeah, buddy! If you're super hardcore, just give it a little. I don't really have to. <laughs> All right guys, thank you for watching my three cheese mac and cheese. And it would really mean a lot to me if you subscribe to have videos every week. And check out the pork belly episode next week, which we're gonna serve this with.